I'd like to thank all of you at St. John Guinea Parish. You have had such a great impact upon the lives of our people here in Puerta. And this group of young people who have come down has been amazing. Their energy, their joy, their compassion to go out. I thank uh, Dave and, and Jerry and Greg and Cynthia for really helping the group uh, reach out and give the love of Jesus to so many people. We pray for you and please pray for us. May God bless you all. Hello, my name is Jerry Stenovich, and I'm here on Mission Weekend to update the parish on our twinning relationship with Santismo Sacramento in Pura, Peru. St. John Vianney has partnered with Santismo Sacramento since 2013, and we have impacted many lives. I would like to introduce you to some of the people we have helped through our programs. There are currently 145 families at St. John Vianney that sponsor a family in Pura through the Family to Family program. The families receive a monthly food delivery, which helps them greatly. In addition, some parishioners at St. John Vianney assist their families further. This is Maria. Her son, Junior, was diagnosed with a seizure disorder four years ago. Her husband is an agricultural worker and makes $5 a week. It was impossible for them to afford the medicine needed for Junior. The family and family sponsors sent the extra funds each month. I saw Junior in August when I visited Pira. He is a happy and grateful 12-year-old boy. This is Yomar and his family with their sponsors. In 2019, Yomar's wife gave birth to twins. They now have six children and he was unemployed. His sponsoring family donated the money needed to purchase a moto taxi, the main source of transportation in Pura. When I visited in 2020, he proudly displayed the operator's license he had just received from the city. I stopped in to see him last month. He wasn't home. His neighbor let me know that Yomar was out working. The Family to Family program can also provide a new home for a family. Since 2013, SJV donors and volunteers have built over 20 new homes. Family members are happy to take part in the project. In a single day, the family has a new home with a separate bedroom for the children, a large kitchen area, and no leaky roof. Each year in January, St. John Vianney has a mission trip to Santissimo Sacramento. The trip is a mix of medical and non-medical parishioners. The non-medical parishioners do various activities, such as deliver food, build homes, or help with English classes. The medical volunteers provide surgery and medical examinations. Since 2014, we have performed over 200 hernia repair surgeries. The untreated hernias prevent the person from working to their full capacity, but unfortunately the people cannot afford to obtain treatment at a local hospital. Our volunteers provide the operation at no cost to the patient. In addition to hernia repairs, we have performed carpal tunnel releases, steroid injections, and seen hundreds of people for medical and dental examinations. The Madre del Redentor Girls Home in Pura is run by a Peruvian order of nuns. About 65 girls between the ages of 12 and 18 live there. They come from villages in the mountains or along the Amazon River. In their community, the girls are often married at a young age against their will and don't have access to education. The home provides a high school diploma and a safe place for them but relies heavily on donations to feed and house, house the girls. During the annual mission trip, SJV missionaries shop for groceries in the open market. We deliver fruit, vegetables, and meat, which will last about two weeks for the girls. Since 2014, SJV has also offered the girls an amazing experience. We rent coach buses and take the girls to the Pacific Ocean. We spend the day swimming and playing games on the beach. For most of the girls, this is the only time in the year that they leave the compound of the girls' home. The nuns have told me that it is a highlight of their year and that the girls are so excited when January comes and they know that St. John Vianney will be visiting. In 2015, the St. John Vianney Trade School opened in Pura. It was funded by no donations from parishioners at SJV in Brookfield. The school provides an education and an opportunity for employment that many in Pura never thought was possible. The school currently has 160 students in the fields of baking, auto mechanics, sewing, cosmetology, computers, and nursing. The cost is $30 a month for two years. 
half of the students are receiving financial help through the SJV Scholarship Fund. I was told by Father Joe, the pastor of Santismo Sacramento, that there continues to be a huge need for further scholarships, as most of the students cannot afford the tuition. There have been several graduating classes since the school's inception, and many alumni are successfully employed. This is Paola and Ivan. They received a full scholarship to attend the baking program. They graduated this year and have started their own business. They make beautiful cakes and cater celebrations. This is Mirna, a recent graduate of the Dr. Jim Wallace nursing program at the school. Her tuition was fully paid by our scholarship fund. She now provides home health care in the community. And this is Edison, another recent graduate of our nursing program. Eddie completed his studies with financial help from the scholarship fund. He has decided to continue his education and is now in medical school in Pira. None of this could have happened without the generous support of St. John Vianney. As you can see, our twinning relationship with Santismo Sacramento has made a huge impact on the parishioners in Peru and at SJV. Every dollar you donate goes directly to the parish to help the poor in Pira. There will be a second collection at the end of Mass today for the Santismo Sacramento Parish. Yeah. If you have an interest in your donation going to a specific program, such as the Scholarship Fund or the Family to Family Program, please stop in the narthex after Mass and talk with a member of the International Twinning Committee. We will also be available to talk to anyone interested in joining the committee or participating in a mission trip in 2023. Thank you very much for your support.